Hello, and I'm here today at Thorpe Park. Really excited to go back to this park. It's one of my favourites in the country. Um, it's incredibly busy today, right in the middle of school trip season. Um, but really excited to get on some favourites, such as Swarm, Stealth, which is my favourite here. Uh, Duke Colossus, which has now got a sister from England uh, in sick. Um, check out some of the uh, Exodus construction, some carnival preparation, so I can spot trailers at the minute. Yeah, really excited to get back here. Gonna make our way over to Colossus, so we'll catch you after Colossus. Join us after Colossus. I managed to do Colossus on the front row. Um, it's a really fun coast on the front, that one. I um, enjoyed it. Charlotte's first time, what do you think? Um, the front's where to ride, that one is why it's too rough. Uh, as you might be able to tell behind me, it is an incredibly busy day here at Thought Park. Um, so we're going to go make our way over to get some food. Uh, this is a new food street boxed up by uh, in Amity that probably check out. Um, to see what's going on over there. Um, so I'll catch you after food and make a part of them. Join us after lunch, went to KFC, banging as always. Good old KFC. Um, making our way over to Rumba Rapids because it is absolutely boiling today. Um, Rapids has only got an half an hour queue, so we're going to make the most of it. Um, so we'll join us after the Rapids. Join us after the rapids. Rapids was a good time. Uh, the waterfall was terrifying. Thought we were going to get soaked, but didn't because we didn't actually go under the waterfall. I had flashbacks to um, the rapids at Energylandia where you do go under the waterfall and get absolutely drenched. So uh, they were quite good. Nice see waterfalls on a uh, rapids as well. It's quite rare in the UK that one. Um, Going to be on. Inferno next. I quite like this one. Inferno's very good, so we'll catch you after Inferno. Join us after Nemesis Inferno. It's a good ride on Inferno, that. Um, it's definitely warmed up. Uh, it's baking in the sun here today, so it's really, really warm. The coast is definitely warmed up. It's quite hot all the It's really, really good. Um, it seems to be dying down a bit. I want to say it's still really busy, but it's not as busy as it was earlier today. <laughs> um, couldn't make it our way up. So everybody's probably in the tidal waves, queue line. Tidal waves have got an 180 minute queue and it's been on that all day. Um, we're going to make it our way over to the Swarm. Um, all right on there. So we'll catch you after the Swarm and go to Swarm Island.
Join us after Swarm. What a ride that was. I think that was the, um, the best ride on Swarm I've ever, ever had. Like, that was incredible. It was so fast and so forceful. And I was on the front row as well. It's a really, really good ride. Um, currently making our way over to Stealth um, to try and get on there. Um, so we'll catch you after Stealth. Hopefully, in the next half an hour, you should die off. And so um, we've come in, in the middle of the pr like prime school visit season. Um, so unfortunately, it is it is slammed, been slammed all day. But hopefully. Around four o'clock, which is in about half an hour's time, that should start to die down because obviously schools are believing three, four, and five. So yeah, catch you after stealth. So back after stealth, pretty good ride. Uh, Charlotte didn't go on it because she doesn't like it. Uh, no. Not a fan of that one. It's, the speed and height isn't for her. However, for me, I got front row stealth. I still think that is the best thing you can do at this park. Um, yeah, until Exodus comes along, uh, I do think that front row stealth is probably the best thing you can do at this park. It's just so good. Uh, making my way over to Saw, I'm going to check out the Exodus um, construction area. Uh, and ride saw, so we'll catch you after, we'll catch you over at Exodus. So behind me is the construction area for Project Exodus, which will be a brand new 236 feet tall roller coaster. The UK's brand new hype coaster. Now, as of recording, which is going to be Wednesday the 13th of July, the latest update was the environmental agency put an objection letter in. Farf have now put in a document to the planning permission addressing those concerns. So behind me, over the next year, six months, we're probably going to be seeing a lot of change. A um, really, really exciting time for UK roller coasters. Um, yeah, so keep your eyes peeled for back here because soon there's going to be a brand new map hyper coaster here. Fingers crossed. You join us after Saw the Ride. Um, I enjoyed the ride, but it's definitely gotten rougher. Um, there's at least some raffles to it. Um, the park is currently like a park, like I kind of said, the park's really died off now. Um, queues have gone from being hour, hour and a half down to 30 minutes. So we're going to go re-ride the Swarm, which is riding fantastic so far today. So uh, we'll catch you guys after. And that is everything for today here at Thought Park. Uh, we managed to get on Nemesis Inferno uh, for the last ride of the day. Did you enjoy Inferno? Inferno was fun. Uh, layout's good. Yeah, fun, intense ride. Running really well today. Um, I still prefer Nemesis at Towers. <laughs> I don't. I don't. <laughs> I think if you took Infer Nemesis out of the uh, Infern uh, Nemesis Inferno's name, it'd be like viewed better. But I've got to compare it to uh, Nemesis at Towers and. That's just about coast for me. Um, if you did enjoy the video, guys, please uh, put a like. If you want to see more, I'll have another video there. And if you want to hit subscribe up there. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.